people. Oh, we want to go on his videos and talk about Jesus, man. He's a fake Christian. It shuts your bitch ass up. And we're just going to, we're going to play the circle. I got a great video coming, by the way, guys. It's, I, I know I've been saying this for a while, but it's, I, I turned it, it was like a small little tips video. Now it's turned into like this really great, probably one of the most game improving videos you will ever watch on YouTube for Fortnite anyways. It doesn't give stupid tips like the best types of trees to farm and, you know, cheese stuff like that. Like I put two minutes of thought into it this is actually one of the best most informative fortnite videos you will ever see on youtube.com oh i get it <laughs> what if i okay you know okay okay <laughs> rhino's funny I guess Rhino's got to diss people to stay relevant. You know what I mean? If I had 1.1 million subscribers and only like 100,000 people are watching my videos, you know, I'd try to diss people too. I know. <laughs> I guess. I guess that, uh, you know, if I didn't talk about God in my videos, you know. True story about Rhino Crunch. The reason why me and Rhino Crunch stop, uh, playing together is because Rhino tried to force me to talk about God in my videos, but I wouldn't do it. I told him that I didn't want to do it, and so Rhino Crunch stopped playing with me. Truth bombs. Now you guys know the real reason. Rhino Crunch went on like a full thing where he wanted me to talk about God and Jesus and... I want to talk about it, so he stopped, he stopped playing with me. <laughs> I guess I guess the cat's out of the bag now. I try to play nice. I shouldn't do this, though, because it just helps Rhino get views. It makes him relevant again. Nobody want to watch your trash videos because you're not good at the game. And <clears throat> because I'm a smart person... If Rhino Crunch tries to deny it, guess what, Rhino? I got every screenshot. <laughs> I saved everything, boy. I even saved the part where you said you wanted to do a charity stream and pocket it. Ooh, my God. Someone call Keemstar. I even saved that part, man. It's very godly of you. Bro, you want to take gloves off, man? Don't don't mis don't mistake my kindness for weakness. This ain't my first rodeo, man. This ain't my first rodeo. I saved everything. The best part about Rhino Crunch is that he tried. Okay, so here's another good part about Rhino Crunch. For the past like two weeks, Rhino Crunch has been trying to message me on Twitter, and yesterday he actually said to me. I didn't reply because I haven't replied to him in a while. Just because I just I don't want to. I just want to be left alone, you know. Like he's just he's mad that I won't respond to him. He's mad that I like he knows that he messed up trying to get me to talk about Jesus, you know. And by the way, I got you know what I mean. Like I'm not dissing like religion or anything, you know what I mean. My my point is is that it's just weird when someone tries to force that on you, you know what I mean. He was trying to call me like a fake Christian, a closet Christian, just all that stuff, man. And I know I shouldn't be talking about this because Rhino Crunch wants this, you know? This is going to help him get noticed. People will talk about him, you know? But it is kind of annoying for him to post something like that. When I, when I gave him the respect of not telling people the truth to why we stopped playing together, you know what I mean? Like, I literally, out of kindness, was like, dude, we're, I'm not going to talk about why Rhino Crunch and me don't play together because it would make him look bad. But, like, if he's going to talk smack, I mean, <laughs> whatever, dude. Let's go, dude. I don't care, dude. I'm a grown man.
I'm ready to battle. Rhino Crunch is a fake, man. He was the true. Here's the true story about Rhino Crunch. Rhino Crunch was such a nice person to me when I met him. All right, like such a nice person, man. And we had a good time. Like, honest to God, like we were, we were, honestly, we were a good duo, man. We, 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 like I would talk to him off stream. We talk. We were so excited about Fortnite, and we were good friends. And until this moment, until he dissed me, like we honestly didn't really diss each other, even off stream. Like we didn't have. We didn't have a big fight or anything, but the truth is, is Rhino Crunch tried to force his, he tried to force me to come out about being a Christian. He, he f wanted to force me to like talk about God in my videos. You know, he said that, you know, your Fortnite's blowing up. That's God's work. And you're not talking about it. You know, you're going to go to hell. Like I'm, I'm telling you, I got all these screenshots, man. He was telling me how like, he's scared for me. Like Jesus is going to strike me down or something like all this stuff, bro. Like, I'm not kidding guys. And it was like, you know, I, I, I told him, I was like, dude, I'm not going to talk about this in my videos, you know? Like, I don't want to do that. And I literally have every screenshot, every single screenshot on Discord of it, you know? And it made me uncomfortable. I didn't want to talk about this stuff. Why try to force that upon me? So Rhino said to me, and I still have all the screenshots. He said to me, he said, uh, he said, what did he say? He said, I just want to surround myself with people who are on fire for Jesus. So I will not play with you anymore, basically. And I was like, okay, like that, that's fine. And then like two weeks later, Rhino felt bad about it. He tried to apologize and say that was wrong in me, you know, but I, I honestly think that Rhino Crunch is a mastermind. I think he only wrote that stuff to cover his butt, you know, so he could screenshot it himself. You know, he's trying to just protect himself. Straight up guys, like, you guys know me. I'm not about, like, drama. I'm not about, like, disrespecting people. But Rhino went full. And I think Rhino dissed me because of my comment I made with C's the other day. Like, he probably... I, I, I know the Rhino camps to stream. He's here right now, man. He's probably boiling that I even admit that told this stuff. But don't mess with me, dude. I'll come out with the truth, man. I tried to be nice to you, dude. You know, I didn't want to tell people... When people told me why me and Rhino stopped playing, I was like, he doesn't want to play with streamers anymore. But the truth is, he doesn't want to play with people that aren't gonna talk about jesus and be and be his like puppet basically he want like rhino crunch basically wants you to be his puppet you want to be his puppet and as soon as uh as soon as rhino as soon as i started getting popular in fortnite rhino like he changed his demeanor man it was like it was the scariest thing ever like he went from being the nicest guy and and straight up guys rhino was so nice he shouted me out on his channel we know you guys know you watched us play man we had a lot of fun and then all of a sudden when I started getting popular in Fortnite, like, Rhino's demeanor changed. He was, like, jealous of me, and he just, you know, then he just wanted me to talk about God in all my videos. It was crazy, dude. Like, what kind of, what kind of person is that, you know? That'll, uh, you know, like, you say you're about, like, kindness and your religion, but you try to force it, and, like, you won't hang out with someone because of that. That's just weird, man. But whatever. And don't even try to play Rhino, because I saved everything, bro. I did nothing. I did nothing to mess with Rhino ever, man. Oh, by the way, guys, one more thing about Rhino Crunch. The next time you watch his video, listen to how weird it sounds knowing that he post-records it. Everything, all his videos... He, he plays he plays with no microphone right and then afterwards he he watches it and talks about it as if he's actually playing and and now that you know that listen to it and see if you can't catch that it sounds kind of creepy like it sounds off a little bit if you know the truth there you go there's another one <laughs> gotcha yo it's hey, hey bro thanks for the five through all the dissing from rhino crunch i think my drop music was forgotten so let's do this i totally want you to still drop that beat at some point all right man i'll advertise your music because for the longest time, people were like, dude, why don't you play with Rhino anymore? You got popular Dakotas. Now you don't want to play with them? It's like, no, dude. The guy wanted me to talk about God every video, you know? Try to force his religion upon me. Well, religious talk about, you know what I mean? <clears throat> Oblivion, thanks for the 565. So glad I came today. Don't let him distract you. Focus on you. Yeah, yeah. We're going to get in the games. We're going to get it. Full son. 
You don't want to mess with me, man. This ain't, this ain't my first rodeo. You know what you said when you go to Las Vegas, what you do. <laughs> you know what you said when you do charity streams, what you going to do. <laughs> you know what you said, son. You better be careful. Yo, Lenardski, thanks for the 500 bits. Says it's okay. You carried him anyways. Yo, Jawzam, thank you for the two months. He says, hmm, why is this coming up twice? Rhino Crunch, if you read this, grow up. Grow up, man. What you gonna tell people? Oh, we wanna go on his videos and talk about Jesus, man. He's a fake Christian. Hey, shut your bitch ass up and try me, boy. I got them recordings of you, man. You test me. You want me to drop you, I'll drop you. Shut your bitch ass up.